Hey guys, welcome back to my video. I'm Melvin. Um, if you haven't seen my video, I do fashion and also I talk a lot about acne scars. And this collaboration I'm having with, it's with a pharmaceutical brand called Galdema. And they actually produce a range of products um, such as feelers. And in this video, I will be doing some treatments that involve these feelers. You will be able to see um, how my skin improves from there. But also because I recently went to Korea for also a skin treatment, acne scar treatment ride. So I just wanted to update you guys on how the skin is going, you know, um, what are the improvements like. Because I'm sure you have been subscribing and watching. And then you can compare the difference um, throughout these different procedures and see it for yourself whether it works or not. Personally, I felt that the Rejuran wasn't as effective as having uh, Rejuran with Substigen. Depending on your skin, every person's um, results might differ, but just personally for me, I just feel that Rejuran plus Substigen was a better treatment for me and more effective. And still, even with fillers, like you can see like the scars are quite obvious. My most concerning part would be the temple area. Um, you can still see that the scars are quite prominent, even from far or you know, at a certain angle when the sun shines, like we cast a shadow. And it has only been like, what, six months or so. Um, it's supposed to last till one year, right? Um, but yeah, um, I think it's something you should try because um, for certain areas with especially thin skin, right? It doesn't really work so well. And if you do like subsidian with Rejuran because just there's there's very little skin there and to lift the tissues you just have to do feel less um, i'm not sure whether it will work this time but i hope so i'm just gonna let the doctor know that i just wanna wanna tackle this temple area and see whether there is a solution that he can propose so keep you guys posted and let's get to it they will not rest at all. So I just did a pre-try, I would say it's like a pre-consultation with the client journey um, expert and then after he will, she will collect my information um, on my concerns and stuff and pass it to the doctor so in this way it makes um, the whole process a lot smoother because the doctor then knows like what kind of patient you are, you like more details or you just like want to get straight into the treatment itself. Maybe you can take a look and mm. tell me like what we talk about your skin first, now, okay? Which is your scars, <laughs> okay? Yeah. If you see here, your temples tend to they sink in, and mm. then you have these large areas where there's depressions, uh, yeah. yeah, atrophic scars. Then we actually also want to stimulate collagen. A variety of injectables you can use here, but collagen stimulants are. So they can thicken the skin, they can improve the mm, so, But um, the in the long run, you will also this is improve, not, right? Yeah. This is not like the Juvederm. Yeah. Okay, like the Juvederm is a hyaluronic acid, right? Mm. So it fills the temple, it might look a little bit nicer initially, then mm. most of that HA disappears. Yeah. Depending on what grade of Juvederm yeah. you use, it could be six months, it could be a year. Okay. Now the other treatment that I thought might be also useful for you is so if you use normal dose this spot you can you can sort of relax these muscles so you don't get that squinty smile mm -hmm. uh, or the the frown but if we use a uh, micro botox it can reduce oiliness improve pore size even when you smile this doesn't get pulled down so much so it lasts about four months typically sometimes it can last about six months then you start to see the muscle activity slowly come back and it's time to repeat again. <laughs> hey guys, now I'm just numbing and today I'm gonna do the sculpture uh, which helps to fill the scars and also over time it will boost collagen naturally which is great um, along with substation as usual you know my favorite um, can't wait to show you guys the results and anyway we're also going to do some fillers here also to you know boost up the jawline the jawline now it's actually good so it's like that yeah time the you Okay. 
So we're doing a slight modification. So we're more comfortable. We're going to do. We're going to subsize first, okay? Keep the use though. Yeah. We need to create a plane. <laughs> Losing the maybe a little bit, okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This a bit, and then we're going to give you some local anesthetic. Botulinum toxin. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna add some botulinum toxin here. This spot. Okay, so we smile. See, you're, you're pulling all this down, okay? Yeah. So the idea with the Botox is to re relax that so you don't squint so much when you're angry face. Okay, actually, we can lighten this also. Relax. So next time when you smile, smile, it's not going to, uh, it's not going to pull like that. Oh yeah. Okay. This makes your eyes sort of squinty. Okay. Hey guys, so if you have been watching till this part, then you must be very interested in the procedures I did and also want to try it for yourself. So if you are facing acne problems or you want to enhance your features, yes, you should be watching this video till the end. So let me just start with what I did in total. I did a Sculptra with subcision. So Sculptra is actually a protein that is um, injected into the skin and it forms like a scaffolding that it merges all the proteins together to stimulate collagen. So think of it like a sponge and it forms collagen in that area where the protein is injected. So that's how it works. But it only happens over time because you can't have all the formulation overnight and you have to take about three to six months to slowly see results even up to a year. And the procedure was quite tedious um, because it requires the doctor, Dr. Jonathan, to poke and pierce through the scars, just like a subsidian video which I did. You can check it out here. So I would say your doctor is very important because they must have the skill to perform subsidian. So sometimes you might see that the subsidian cost is quite high. It's not just purely because of um, the product used. So previously I used Umridge Run. And this time around, I tried Sculptra, and Sculptra is actually a product from Galdama. You can try both and see which one works better for you. Now, the second thing is I did this spot. So, this spot is a type of botulinum toxin A, which commonly you would know as Botox. So, it helps to release the tension in the muscles and help to, you know, adjust and better work your muscles. My key area was my eyes, where I have an eye smile which I didn't like it, so I wanted to, you know, ease the folds here. 
So then botulinum toxin A, this spot was injected into here, here. And going to the third, I did Restylane Lift, which is a filler by Gaudama. So they have a different variety for different uses. So what I had was I did a enhancement using fillers on my lower jaw, um, chin area, area around here to actually enhance my lower jaw. And so then I also have a wider jaw now and also I did a nose enhancement here so you can actually see that my I used to have like a dent and then a hump so now it's a bit more flattened out but it still looks very natural because we didn't really do much as in you know it's like that if you know you know but you will never know so that's kind of how it works honestly if you have already decent features and you want to you know take it further that's how sh you should use um Restylane. so for sculpture subsidian it took a really long time because um, apparently my skin was very tough and very difficult to break through and so the doctor had to you know use a lot of force to actually use the cannula to you know tear the tissue apart that almost took about 40 to 50 minutes And was it painful? Let's go by a rating of 5. Um, I would say it's just a 1 because it's not pain but it's quite uncomfortable. You can feel the needle poking through your tissues and you can hear um, the scars tearing. Only some parts you'll get soreness. And then for this spot wise, so I did this spot in here but only at a very little quantity so it was just like end bite. So I would say that it's also a 1 out of 5. And then the last which is Restylane um, fillers. Different part of the areas actually felt differently. So for the jaw, it was um, less painful, but the nose, it was really painful. Talking about the jaw area, only here there's a lot of tendons, so it felt a bit more difficult to numb. The part where you will feel pain is actually the numbing part because of course when the LA anesthesia was injected, you can't actually feel anything and also the fillers actually contains 1% of the anesthesia product. While it's being injected into your system, you will slowly feel it. So in a sense, after a while, you can't feel anything at all. But the initial part is um, the uncomfortable part. So I would say this area was a 3 out of 5 in terms of pain. And for the nose, I did the injection injection here and also here. This part and this part is super pain. I would say it's a 4 out of 5 but you just have to get through the numbing and then you'll be alright. So talking about pain, that brings me to my next part where I talk about costs. Speaking about consultation first, so consultation will be $200 at a flat fee I check with um, the clinic. And then we talk about the Botox which is this spot. Upper face areas, um, it costs about $800. And the price will be lower if actually you use a lesser volume. I just like injected two lines, that's all. It takes like 4 seconds or maybe 10 seconds. But anyway, that's the price range you're looking at. For a better price gauge, go consult. Okay, for Sculptra, Sculptra is the most expensive because the doctor actually took a lot of time doing the Sculptra. So it really depends on the area um, that you need to work on. And for me, it was almost my entire face, especially with focus in the temple area and also the cheeks area. It will be around 1,800 per vial. And there's also a package pricing available. So if you say you want to do it every six months, um, they actually have a package in store for you. And moving on, the fillers, Restylane. So fillers, there's also a package. The a la carte pricing is about 1,400. You're looking around that price. For the record, this treatment was a collaboration with Gaudama. So they sponsored all the products and the clinic sponsored the services. So I, I'm just being transparent with you. Definitely if you are concerned about price, you definitely want to compare um, the price. But one thing to take note is actually the doctor's skill is very important, especially when it comes to shaping your face um, because uh, it takes judgment to know how much to put, which area to put and how to shape it. So the last part, let's talk about results. So it has been three months since um, I did the procedure. I did it over a course of about four weeks because I did various sessions to you know not have um, 
implications of different treatments. After three months, I felt that overall it has really significantly improved. The temple area and the cheeks area improved so much. This area no longer sinks down when I smile. So here's to a better smile and looking younger. And also the fillers part. This one nobody noticed. So I was living my day-to-day -day life normally uh, without telling um, the people around me. Which is a good thing if you don't want to be too obvious about what you do. You don't want to show up in the office the next day and then you give others a shock. It's like, whoa. That's suspicious. That's weird. You don't want to be overdoing it and you just want to have that little enhancement that makes you so good in photos. I think the nose was like enhanced into a 20% kind of increment and the jaw wise also I got a very defined jaw which will last 6 to 12 months and yes if you want to do it I highly recommend it but if there's no need to do then there's no need for you to do. So with that, I've come to the end of my video. If you have any other questions, um, do leave it down in the comments below. I'm happy to answer you. And also check out my Instagram. Don't forget to subscribe, like and comment if you want to see more videos like this. And I'll catch you on the next one. For when I... <laughs> for now, it's just like... <laughs> 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 Botulinum toxin. Botulinum toxin.